Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my channel if this is your first time seeing my face. My name is Aisha and in today's video we are going to be doing my favorite go-to nude lip combinations. I wear nude lips all the time so I kind of feel like this is just the perfect video for me to do and I decided to record this video because in, in my pretty little thing haul and in my style with me that's one of like the most requested most asked about thing what lip combo do you have on what lip combo do you have on and it just gave me the idea to go ahead and do a nude dark skin girl friendly lip combination video because i know i searched up videos like that so i decided to do this and we got some good ones for you guys okay like this one is so cute so cute but anyways, before we get into the video, make sure if you aren't already that you subscribe to my channel because, you know, we're girlfriends, we're friends, okay? And, you know, I want you to be part of the family, I want you to be part of the team, I want you to be part of the squad so that, you know, whenever I share new tips, new style tips, new hair tips, new makeup tips, you know, you're the first to know, okay? Got yeah, notified because it's subscribe. <laughs> JK, but no, make sure you subscribe and make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Let's just get into the video. So, my go to lip combination is Max Chestnut Lip Liner with Abu Dhabi. These together, okay, they're any brown girl's like friend, like girl. If you don't have this combination in your closet, I mean, in your makeup bag, what are you doing? Get with the program. Let me show you what it looks like. That's chestnut on, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put Abu Dhabi on. And that is what that just looks like. Now, with this on, I feel like something that I always do is, is go ahead and take a lighter color and put it in the middle. And honestly, I do this more often than not. Um, and I will take London, because London is literally just a shade lighter than Abu Dhabi. So I go in with London and put that in the middle and I'm gonna show you what that looks like. So that is kind of like the first lip combination that we have going on. And this is considered like, this is saying that I would leave it matte, which I almost never do. I never just do a matte lip, but this is really cute actually. Like we're having like a nude moment. Now, we're not gonna take this lippy to another level. I mix all my colors together because that's just what I do, okay? You have to make makeup work for you, and that's something that I've been saying. You have to make makeup work for you because I feel like you can't just take whatever somebody else is doing and photocopy it onto your face because you guys don't have the same face, you don't have the same features. It's like saying somebody that already has super duper juicy lips and then they go ahead and overline their lips. You're gonna look like like you're gonna look like a clown. Like, you don't need to do that. You just need to do what works for your lips. So for me, this works, and this is cute, and I like it, but I want to take it another step further. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this lip liner from Pixie in the color Black Cocoa, and it's like a darker brown color, and I'm going to show you what it does. I'm only going to put it like in the high points of my lips, and I'm going to show you what that does for me. That is what we look like. So I just feel like when I do that and I put a darker color like on the tip of my, I don't even know what to call it, like the actual line of my lip and give it that ombre like um, effect, it just, I don't know. I don't know what it does. I just really like it. But yeah, I would say that this is very, very brown skin girl, dark skin girl friendly for a nude lippy. So I'm going to go ahead and go, I'm going to start with the darkest color this time from Pixie and go ahead and take Chestnut 
Just do like those same lip liner combinations and then I'm gonna show you what glosses I use together. I'm telling you guys, you need to pick up this lip liner. This eye, it's an eyeliner, but like I said, make makeup work for you, okay? You can use it as an eyeliner, you can use it as a lip liner. Anyways, I'm gonna take chestnut now and just do the same thing. Don't you just like love what's going on right here, right now? So anyways, next thing that I'm gonna go ahead and do is take this lip gloss plumper from e.l.f. and it's called Mocha Twist and I wear this all the time. Like she, she is so cute. She does it for me. Like I don't know when she doesn't do it for me. She's very cute and she's cute alone by herself too. So I'm gonna show you what that looks like. I didn't even need like a lip stain, lipstick, nothing under this. It just looks so cute. This is what this lip combination looks like. And I think it's so cute. So we're gonna take this lip combo another step up. And it's kind of like the same thing that I did with the mattes. And I'm gonna take this MAC lip, it's a, called a lip glass. And this is what it looks like. And I'm gonna show you what that's gonna do for it. This right here, this right here. Like, I mean, this is literally so cute. Like, wait, are you serious? This is the gloss version of the last lip combination that I showed you guys, and it's really, really cute. So I'm gonna wipe this off and move on to the next one. The next lip combo I'm gonna be working with is Night Moth, and Night Moth is very similar to Chestnut, in the sense that it is also dark skin girl friendly and chocolate girl friendly but it brings something different to the table like if i were to do a red lip as opposed to using chestnut as the liner i would use night moth that is what night moth looks like on its own on a dark skin girl, okay? So I'm gonna be taking the NYX Lingerie Lippy in the shade Seduction. So do you see what I'm saying? This gives a more berry, like, tone, like vibe. It gives a berry vibe. So if I were working with more like purple and just red almost colors in my eye this is the type of lip i would opt for and i'm telling you right now she makes sense like this looks so good this looks so good and to take it another step i'm gonna go ahead and put a gloss over it and i'm gonna be taking the um mac lip gloss actually So I'm gonna be doing two more lip combinations and you guys should literally be good to go after this video, okay? Like I gave you all, all of my like nude-esque lip combinations. So my next lip combo is um, starting off with this Fenty, I don't even know what she calls this. Okay, this Fenty is called, I don't know if it's called Mademoiselle or PMS, one of the two, but says that shade at the bottom and this still gives the same very like a very similar vibe as night moth but with this you also get like a lippy a full lippy so that's why I also like it but what I do when I use this I'm gonna show you and that's really cute actually what I'm gonna do now is take London from NYX and put that all in the middle Mm, that feels and looks so good. Oh, 
Okay, so for this next lip combination, I'm just kind of showing you like an alternative to like the first one that I did, like with the lip liners. So we have beauty supply store alternatives, but any random dark, like even like eyebrow pencil from the beauty supply store will work and I pair it with um, Morphe's lip liner called Trendsetter and it gives that same you know it mimics the same look as chestnut and black brown from pixie and mac and I'm gonna show you I'll tell you right now, this brown on its own is very cute and it's just called dark brown and it, the brand looks like it's just called eye pencil. I don't even know but it's one of those beauty supply store colors and it looks so good on its, on its own. Like I would just throw gloss on top of this and be about my way but you know we're extra so that's not why you clicked on this video. You clicked on this video for my extra. We're going to go ahead and put trendsetter right on top of this. So that's the combination together. As you can see, it looks very, very similar to Chestnut and the Pixie combination. So the lippy I'm gonna take now is also from NYX and it's called I Woke Up Like This. And I just wanted to show you just like the different combinations that you could use. I could literally stick to the same three, four lip glosses and um, lip stains, but you know, I wanted to give you guys some diversity. So, yeah. so I hope you guys like um, my favorite lip, like nude lip combination. But yeah, honestly, you just have to use what kind of works for you play around with some stuff but if i would tell you to get anything from this haul like three things i would tell you to get from this haul not haul from this video rather are chestnut but yeah i would tell you to get chestnut i would tell you to get the pixie eyeliner in the shade black cocoa and it's very inexpensive as well and abu dhabi because Abu Dhabi is very, very dark skinned, black girl friendly, and you can use it with almost any lip liner. And I just think it looks so good. But I would recommend all of these to you, okay? I would recommend all of these to you. They all give you a little something different, and I just love them. Like, I actually like this last one a lot. I used to wear this a lot back in the day, but I found new products, and I haven't worn this in a while. But dang, like, I might, might. I might be using this a little bit more because this is so cute anyways thank you guys so much for watching today's video i hope you enjoyed it i hope you were able to take something away from it and um yeah tell me which one was your favorite in the comment section and make sure you give it a big old thumbs up because that helps me and i really appreciate it and last but not least make sure you subscribe to my channel so i can see you next time you know Turn on the post notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys so much. Bye.